Can I ask a question just out of curiosity? Yes, sir. If guns are meant to deter the threat of crime, what's the point of concealing them? I mean, wouldn't you want the criminal to see that you've got a gun? I suppose you would. And what's the answer to that? I really don't know, sir. You don't know? No, sir. I suppose the concern has more to do with the threat to the Second Amendment. We can't all just agree it's a stupid-ass amendment that was written before there were street lamps, much less police forces, and move on? Sir. There's no need for a citizen militia. I agree with you. Then say so. Forty percent of Americans have a gun in their home. Only 16 percent believe gun ownership is an absolute right. Only nine percent believe it's an absolute wrong. There's a middle. We can win them. Not when we're running the MS defense, Mr. President. Which we wouldn't have been doing if... If what, sir? Nothing. Sir. You outed me, John. With that trip to Nashua. With the oil companies. You wanted people to start asking questions. I needed to start running because nobody told me that I wasn't. And you announced that I found out on television. So did my wife. This whole thing was mismanaged, sir. Look. It was blown. Yes, it was. Yes, it was. Not easy being my vice president, is it? No, sir. I wouldn't think so. But it's the only way you're going to get the nomination. You know that, right? If I win. Yeah. And the only way you're going to win is if I'm on the ticket. You know that, don't you, sir? Yeah. You'll go to Texas. I want a seat at the table. Yeah. Mr. President. Yeah. They're getting ready for you in the briefing room. Thank you. I'll be back in my office. Yeah. Is there anything else, sir? No. Thank you, Mr. President. <laughs>